But China, of course, the future of aviation in the PRC is on display. And a, a GE Safran joint venture is ready to take off in China. Uh, Shaker Sharour. Executive Vice President at CFM International joins us from Singapore today. This is a 50-50 joint venture between General Electric, the aircraft engine major, and the Safran Group. CFM won a contract to exclusively supply engines for the C919. We can seat up to like 160, 170 people and will enter service in about the year 2016. Joins us from Singapore today. Shaker, good morning to you. Must be a very proud moment good to morning. you to be, uh, to be basically, you know, a, a jet, a plane is nothing without the thrust, without the engines. And at this point, this is a $10 billion uh, deal uh, which you got the sole supplier why was it necessary for CFM to be in on this project well it's, it's very pretty simple really um, you know China is a big player in the aviation market right now and they will be a big player in the aviation industry uh, sooner or later um, and we didn't really want to be left out of that market um, they represent about 10 percent of the total aviation market and um, uh, they they have uh, you know started wanting to build their own airplane uh, back a few years ago with the ARJ and uh, they learned tremendously from that and uh, this mm -hmm. is sort of the uh, next step in the evolution uh, with the C919 um, and we have the right product uh, we think is going to be a commercially successful airplane uh, and we want it to be on it. Uh, Shaker, give me some of the mechanics of how this is going to be done. Is it going to be produced in China? Uh, what is the, uh, what, how do the suppliers fit in? How much of a hybrid is this going to be from technology uh, cherry-picked from uh, other places? Basically, the whole process of getting these C919 power plants, uh, you know, onto the, under the wings and, uh, and, and moving the aircraft. Yeah, well, um, uh, this is actually a brand new product for, uh, for us, and, and a new design for the engine. It's an engine that, that's uh, uh, really tailored for the uh, C919. Um, the uh, design of the engine itself um, and the nacelle that goes around the engine uh, will be done in a traditional way that we have been done it, um, um, uh, at CFM. Uh, so it will be done in co uh, cooperation between um, our company, GE, and our partners in France, SNECMA. Um, now, sourcing of the parts uh, will, is, will be global, just like we've always had uh, global sourcing. Um, there perhaps will be some level of uh, manufacturing of the components that go into the engine in China, um, but ultimately the final assembly of the engine and uh, the propulsion system uh, will be done, um, will be assembled in China and will be done uh, very close to the airplane to really maximize efficiency uh, of the manufacturing process and will be brought up to the airplane and essentially um, um, bolted onto the engine. And, and How that's, much? Uh, that's this, this is, Jake Shaker. This is just an opening salvo, right? I mean, there's many, many more years, many, many more stories in the China aviation space uh, to come. What kind of a role is CFM going to play in 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 that evolution? Uh, well, you, you know, we 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 we've, obviously we have uh, uh, pretty big ambitions and pretty big plans in in China. This is the first salvo, like you said. Uh, we're going to see how the market develops, and um, uh, you know, we we just kind of really ha make sure that we have the right product at the right time. And, and if uh, this develops into a bigger airplane, uh, we want to be ready to be on that airplane as well. Um, you know, we, both of our parent companies uh, really have, want to play big in China. They both have already have big presence in China, and we want to continue that presence, and whether uh, it's in the aviation industry or the other industry. How much is a, ahead, of sorry. this is aimed at actually introducing technology into China? China is hungry for technological innovation. This is a joint venture product. China is requiring local participation. Is this going to end up on the hands of the Chinese? Well, the, the, engine, the engine itself is not really a joint uh, venture. It, it's, uh, the engine is a CFM engine. It's so owned by CFM. All of the IP ri rights and the technology is, is the right. ownership of, of um, CFM. Um, okay. so, so we really are a supplier, 